I am Santosh Gaidanka. Today I am teaching you the clutches problem. The first concept I am teaching you that is single plate clutch. This is the design procedure for the single plate clutch. This is the torque. I mentioned the page number here, the diameter of the shaft, and I am using the data handbook Lingaya. If the diameter is not given, then you have to assume as D2 is equal to 3D1 the mean diameter of the frictional lining uniform pressure uniform wear axial force this formula we have to use for uniform wear condition again this formula is used in order to find out the FA that is axial force these are the dimension of the clutches we have to use this formula for measuring the thickness thickness of the disc ranges from H is equal to 1 to 3 mm okay I will considering the first problem I am using the Lingaya data handbook okay now first problem is nothing but design a design a single plate clutch to transmit 30 kilowatt I have to transmit a 30 kilowatt 30 kilowatt I will consider n is equal to 30 kilo watt and n is equal to 1200 rpm design a single plate clutch single plate is nothing but I is nothing but two you have to do that means two frictional linings are provided the meaning is a single plate is a two frictional line sometime they will specifically mention single plate only one frictional line in that case I is equal to one you have to take it 30 is mentioned outer diameter outer diameter is nothing but d2 is equal to 1.5 of inner diameter and it is lined with the asbestos having the allowable pressure p is given here it is nothing but 0 0.24 mega pascal and the coefficient of friction mu is nothing but 0 0.3 okay we have to design now i am using the linga data handbook this is the Lingaya data handbook. Now I will go for uh, ah, this is the page number 19.9. You have to go for disc clutches. This is nothing but single plate uh, single plate clutch formulas, list of the formulas. Okay. Instead of going the step by step, I will go directly here. I will go directly solution solving this problem what are the requirement f is equal to 1 by 2 into pi p d1 d2 minus d1 the condition is given here if you substitute the value of d1 you will get uh, d1 square here but we required fa fa can be obtained by using this formula mt is equal to 1 by 2 into pu mu is equal to fa divided by dm into i okay we can substitute here fa value but we required MT value before doing the MT value we required DM for DM uniform pressure and uniform wear there are two formulas use this formula or this either, either use this formula or this formula I am using this one because the condition is given D2 is equal to 1.5 D1 and substitute uh, the DM will be the DM value will be come this value has to be substituted here I is nothing but 2 first I have to find out the MT value what is MT value empty formula is nothing but what torque for this one empty value is nothing but this is the empty value empty is nothing but here we are using this formula okay just I will make it proper zoom here okay this is the empty value I will use it 955 N I will substitute here nine five five zero n divided by n now nine five five zero n is nothing but thirty n is nothing but thirty thirty divided by twelve hundred the answer will be two three eight seven five zero Newton mm. 
this is your empty value next what we required as per this diagram I'm not following the procedure I'm just adding doing directly here because the few problems are there where procedure doesn't require you have to just follow the formulas given in the data handbook okay once empty is known FA we have to find out before going for FA I will go for DM in the DM I will go for uniform wear step 1 is completed step 2 DM is nothing but 1 by 2 1 by 2 D2 plus D1 for uniform wear there are two condition uniform wear and uniform pressure you can consider any one uniform wear I will go for now 1 by 2 D2 is nothing but 1.5 D1 plus D1 1 by 2 D1 outside 1.5 plus 1 the answer will be for this one is 1.25 D1 now DM is known now DM is known substitute in this formula sorry before the substituting in here find out FA value find out FA value now FA formula for FA is nothing but what FA is equal to FA is equal to 1 by 2 this is the formula I'm using it FA is equal to 1 by 2 1 by 2 pi P D1 D2 minus D1 I'm using it now 1 by 2 into pi P is nothing but 0 0.24 into D1 as it is D2 is nothing but 1.5 D1 minus D1 1 by 2 pi into 0 0.24 into D1 into D1 D1 is a common 1.5 minus 1 total answer will be for this one is a thing but if you uh, calculate it will be 0 0.1884 D1 square this is your FA value now MT is known 1 by 2 is known mu is known FA is known DM is known I is known you can find out the diameter I'll substitute in this formula here in this formula that is MT is equal to MT is equal to 1 by 2 mu FA DM I in the data handbook I is missing write it as I here the MT already known 2 3 8 7 5 0 is equal to 1 by 2 into mu is 0 0.3 into FA is nothing but 0 0.1884 D1 square DM is nothing but 1.25 D1 I is nothing but 2 now it becomes D cube here it this and this become D cube therefore the final answer for this one is nothing but final answer for this one is nothing but D1 is equal to 150.03 mm it becomes D cube cross multiply and go for cube you will get this answer once you get this one go for D2 D2 is nothing but 1.5 into 150.03 is nothing but 225.045 mm once you get this one go for FA value FA is nothing but 0 0.1884 into D1 value D1 is nothing but 150.03 whole square the answer will be 424 0 0.69 Newton the thickness thickness of disk H is nothing but what the thickness of this H is ranges from 1 to 3 here 1 to 3 in the data and book thickness ranges from 1 to 3 you can consider H is equal to 2 mm now in final in finding the diameter of the shaft if you are finding the diameter of the shaft then you have to use a diameter of the shaft you have to use the formula here 
this is the formula you have to use for diameter of the shaft this is the formula and d is equal to cube root 16 mt neta pi sigma tau d tau d you have to take as 65.72 we have to assume it this is tau d and neta should be m uh, 1 then you will obtain the d value okay i will uh, substitute this value here first i will consider the formula d is equal to root 16 mt divided by instead of neta i will consider directly pi tau d assume every time you have to assume tau d as a tau d or tau s here is yes okay yes is nothing but uh, 65.72 mega pascal you have to assume it every time okay now substitute this value d is equal to root 16 cube 16 mt is nothing but mt is nothing but 238 75 750 divided by pi into 65.72 the answer will be 26.44 approximately 27 mm I have done directly here okay you can do directly or step by step no problem okay I will go for second problem the second problem is nothing but this is the second problem I have to I will going to do here okay second problem a single plate clutch having a single side friction lining now here friction lining is single therefore I is nothing but what one here uh, rotate at 1500 rpm and outside diameter and inside diameter of frictional linings are outside diameter d2 is nothing but 180 mm and uh, d1 is nothing but 90 mm the respectively the coefficient of friction mu is given here 0 0.25 and allowable pressure is nothing but p is given 0 0.12 mega pascal and determine the power you have to find out the power here that's it power and n is given here 1500 rpm okay you can directly solve this directly solve by using the direct formulas this uh, formula directly available here for finding the uh, power for finding the power the formula is directly available here use this formula use this formula use this formula and directly you can obtain the for, uh, solution that is n is nothing but therefore n is nothing but i mu p n d1 d2 square minus d1 square divided by 24305 ki k1 or ki something is written there every time k1 is nothing but 1 you have to assume it as next substitute the value i is nothing but 1 mu is nothing but 0 0.25 uh, p is nothing but 0 0.12 into d1 is nothing but 90 next 180 whole square minus 90 whole square divided by 24305 into 1 into 1 and finally we will obtain n is equal to 4.09 into 10 raised to 3 watt it is 4.09 kilowatt or the you can you can you can use the same procedure in found finding the n value there are two ways one is the step by step procedure otherwise you can directly by using this formula you can substitute you can obtain a power capacity this second problem I will go for third problem here this is the third problem In the third problem what happened design a single plate clutch to transmit here what happened data is missing here P is given sorry N is given capital N is given 12 kilowatt 
at Tn is equal to 2000 RPM and this much only they have given it next what we have to do for this one we don't know the uh, but one more thing is single plate clutch is given that is I is equal to 2 they have given it uh, now we don't know mu therefore you have to consider assume assume here you have to go for the page number page number 19.26 table 19.7 in this one I am selecting the leather in order to find out the mu value in the leather I will go for dry the conditions are dry wet condition I will go for dry in the dry it is mu is ranges from 0 0.3 to 0 0.5 I will consider in between mu is equal to I will consider in between mu is equal to mu is equal to 0 0.4 next this is the P maximum pressure mega Pascal I have to consider in between this one therefore I will consider uh, P is equal to 0 0.2 to mega Pascal these are the conditions you have to you have to take by using this table Linger data handbook 19.26 one more condition we don't know the diameter once you don't know the diameter as per the procedure as per the procedure this is a procedure if the diameter is not given then you have to take as d2 is equal to 3 d1 I will consider this one assume assume d2 is nothing but 3 d1 this is for the leather next I will go by step by step here first I will find out the torque step 1 consider the torque formula will be mt is equal to 9550 n divided by small n 9550 into 12 divided by 2000 the answer will be 57300 newton mm next step 2 I have to find out the shaft diameter of the shaft shaft or you can do directly no problem you will get the answers t is equal to 3 root 16 mt divided by tau pi tau s assume assume tau s is nothing but 65.72 mpa substitute here t is equal to root 16 into 57300 pi into 65.72 answer will be 16.44 approximately 17 mm next step 3 step 3 I will assume uniform wear disc clutch I will go for a disc clutch this is a disc clutch you can do directly or step by step no problem where is the thing but dm is equal to 1 by 2 d2 by d1 where I will consider dm is equal to 1 by 2 d2 plus d1 we are assuming this d2 is nothing but 3 d1 1 by 2 into 3 d1 plus d1 it becomes 4 therefore 1 by 2 4 d1 is nothing but 2 d1 and dm we got it out next axial force this is the axial force substitute here value step 4 axial force axial force fa is equal to 1 by 2 1 by 2 pi p 
d d2 minus d1 1 by 2 pi into p is nothing but 0 0.2 into d1 is nothing but we don't know d1 d1 as it is d2 is nothing but 3 3 d1 d1 minus d1 if you substitute the value it will be 0 0.283 d1 square this is the fa value once you know the fa value step 5 step 5 go for this formula mt is equal 1 by 2 into mu into fa d by dm into i you will get the answer mt is equal to 1 by 2 mu fa dm by i ft is already known 5 7 3 triple 0 1 by 2 mu is nothing but 0 0.4 fa is nothing but this value 0 0.283 d1 square into dm is nothing but dm is nothing but 2 d1 into 2 into 2 it becomes cube here it becomes a cube this and this becomes a cube and the answer will be d1 is nothing but 48.48 approximately 49 mm and d2 will be 3 d1 3 into 49 is nothing but 147 mm therefore fa is nothing but what fa is equal to 0 0.2831 into d1 is nothing but 49 whole square whole square the answer will be 150 8.55 newton and thickness of the plate last step 6 thickness of the plate is nothing but you can take it to thickness of the plate directly you can write it as this is nothing but it ranges from 1 to 3 thickness of plate h is nothing but 2 mm I am Santosh Gajankar thank you very much